Hi friends, now let us take up the program number 3, OFG3. This also focuses on uh, fu the functionality of uh, SOP statements. Here I am focusing on uh, arithmetical operations. As I told you already, SOP statement not only printing uh, data, it can perform arithmetic uh, operations also. Arithmetic operations are uh, string concatenation operations and all that it can perform. As far as arithmetical operations are concerned, it, those are performed subject to the rules of precedence and associativity. If you do not know these rules and all that, after few chapters you can understand. However, you try to understand that they are simple. In your schooling only you might have learned the bad mass rule and all that. Here, however, a simple briefing I am giving. In all the three statements, I am using uh, plus minus multiplication and division. In this, multiplication and division are having higher precedence. So, wherever these are uh, written in the expression, these are executed first. Next, second priority is plus and minus. That is operator rules of operator precedence. Okay. Of associativity is there. Suppose in a expression, plus in multiplication and division both are there and which is to be executed first, that is the, then in order of occurrence, first multiplication is written, multiplication is executed first, first division is written, division is executed first. Uh, and uh, after these set are over, then these are executed. These basic rules you must know. One thing I am telling you, if you do not know basics, simple basics and all that, uh, uh, OCJP exam is not the uh, right thing, right choice for you. Okay, you should know everything, not only basics. Okay, now we see here three SOP statements I have given. Let us see the result. Here, four operators are there, plus, minus, multiplication, division. So, first multiplication uh, and division is performed. Multiplication, 3 into 4, what is that? 12. 12. Thereafter, uh, by 5. By 5, 12 by 5. Actually, here, integer division happens. In case of integer division, regardless of the accuracy of the result, integer is the result. Here, 2.4 uh, uh, is not the result, 2 is the result. 2 is the result. Okay. Now, last 3, 4, 5 are executed. Thereafter, before that, what are there? Then 1 plus 2 is there. 1 plus 2 is there. 1 plus 2 is 3 minus 2 is 1. So, 1 is the result. In that way, you have to calculate. So, for this purpose, in order to evaluate the statement, which knowledge you should have, uh, the rule of precedence, rule of associativity, and uh, result of integer division. Three points, if you know, you can tackle that. And one more, you see, similar way, only thing is, the placement of operators are different. Same operands I have given. Here you see, first, what is there? Uh, 1 plus 2 into 3 uh, minus 4 by 5 is there. So, how these are executed? First, 2 into 3 are executed. 2 into 3 comes to 6. 4 by 5, integer division, 0. Uh, 0. And uh, now, uh, this is 6. Before that, what is there? Now, this comes. Then 1 plus 6, 7. 7, that is the result. So, here also, the same three rules, operator, precedence and associativity, as well as the result of the integer division, you must know. Okay. Third SOP statement, we see. Here, uh, what are there? Uh, 1 plus 2 by 3 minus 4 into 5. So, which is executed first, this is executed first, this is executed next, this is executed third, this is executed four. Okay. Now, this is 2 by 3, 0. 4 into 5, uh, 20. Now, you see that. 1 plus, 1 plus 0 minus 20 is equal to minus 19. Minus 19. Actually, one tip I give you. 
this type of uh, statement program you write don't execute without executing manually you calculate result for all the program whatever test demos you are making don't execute after executing computer never come to mistake you may come to mistake because of uh, you may not know the rule that's why that's why what i what you do manually calculate thereafter execute and verify with the result and then you can understand which points you are missing this is the way in most cases you have to where you can man, manually calculate you calculate and thereafter execute the statement uh, program and compare the result and uh, both are not matched where you are missing uh, you can understand that is the right way you never miss all the points you may miss few points one or two points suppose here operator precedence i explained operator associativity i explained integer division i explained you may you may miss one point on integer division so like that this is the right way of preparation